uh, but uh, when I was four years old girl, uh, my parents moved to Siberia, to Hantamansisk region, to Nyagan city. So 13 years uh, we lived there and uh, in Nyagan I start, I began my biathlon career. My, in the beginning that was a cross-country skiing career and then in a few years biathlon. Minsk uh, is my home now and uh, always I felt that uh, Belarus and Minsk is my native place. And during my Siberia life, <laughs> every summer I came back to Minsk to my grandmother's and spent the summer here. I don't spend so much time in Minsk city because mostly <laughs> of the time we are in training camp and uh, training camp somewhere aboard or in Raubici center. But some one week or a few days uh, when you are here in the city, it's possible to make some uh, good, good or also easy training. Also, when you live in big city, it's not a problem to make sport and uh, biathlon also because uh, we have also one uh, bicycle road and if I go around uh, all road uh, it's take about two and a half hour on bike. I feel myself here very nice and uh, very calm uh, because uh, it's your hometown and when you come back after uh, big travel and in the forest uh, you feel a little bit more civilization. <laughs> there. Maybe we could, uh, we could rent also this uh, water bike or what is it? <laughs> and here, uh, right on this place, uh, many years ago, <laughs> uh, when I lived in Siberia, in Nyagan, uh, and I came back to Minsk for summertime, uh, visit uh, my grandmothers, and uh, I spent a lot of time in city, and uh, a lot of time on uh, summer house of my grandmother. And this in this uh, summer house place, I make a lot of biking and swimming. And when I came back to Minsk, every day I came to this place for inlines and practice a little bit with some <laughs> cool things on these wheels. Family is the most important thing in life for all people should be because it's your support in all uh, different sides of life. From a childhood, uh, what I felt from my parents, they always uh, gave me freedom and uh, freedom in my choice in life. So in uh, spite of that, uh, of they are architect family <laughs> and they don't push me in this way and uh, let me to make my choice in the sport life. Uh, at six years old, I start my sport, my biathlon, and uh, I follow my brother uh, to cross-country section, uh, cross-country school. And I was the uh, youngest, uh, youngest girl on all this team. And so uh, I had a lot of attention from all these people. And uh, that was a really nice time for me. And uh, in um, a group where I train, uh, there have been only boys and my coach uh, uh, took, took me there. I don't know why and uh, by which reason, but uh, after some months or few years, uh, I understood that yes, I, I can compete with these boys. I remember my first uh, race on World Cup, uh, that was uh, Ostersund in 2006. 
so I uh, ran to finish line, but <laughs> I chose the wrong corridor and then came back, but still uh, I took uh, place in top 15, so that was a uh, good beginning for me and also inspiration for next next days, next World Cups. In April was a nice time, uh, it was a holidays, uh, like for oral uh, battles, and uh, I spent this time in surfing. Uh, was uh, a little bit different from uh, skiing, <laughs> but still uh, amazing, uh, good uh, emotions I've got. And in normal days uh, off during the camps, so it's uh, time to, to relax. Whatever you do, you think about your sport <laughs> because you go for some sightseeing, uh, some sight. Uh, city viewing and uh, you make recovery for a brain but uh, with uh, back uh, minds about your uh, relaxation for your sport. <laughs> it's uh, very important for me to feel harmony in life and to, uh, if you are too much uh, in these uh, competitions and this uh, fighting always, uh, for me it's uh, necessary to move a little bit out uh, with, uh, with my mind. So to be, to be in a family or to think about some nice things. I want to be, first of all, a happy woman and have a happy family. And uh, where that will be. <laughs> so I, feel, I, I think more about how that will be. And uh, what's about other, other sports? So if... Uh, <laughs> If to think about dancing like sport, <laughs> I like this sport. <laughs> Good thing in sport uh, that uh, make you stronger and stronger to other things in life. And uh, we have uh, a good example, and uh, we had him in our team. Is Klaus Siebert, how strong he is uh, in life now, and I think uh, a lot of uh, this power he took from sport. I think uh, people who come from sport to normal life, they are stronger and really good educated uh, to achieve goals. And uh, to achieve goals in sport is, uh, I think, is the best school to achieve goals in life also.